Morning penguins, how are we doing? Are you good? Right, today's Wednesday and today we are going to be looking at doing some maths today. So we're going to do some adding together up to 10. Um, if you can't go up to 10, that's fine. I'm going to go through it and show you what we're going to do. And it's not really related so much to road safety, but it kind of is because you get things like this, which is a speed limit, which means a car is not allowed to go above 30. If you see 30, some may have 20, 40, 60, and I think they do a 50 as well. So that's all the different speed limits and that means that the car is traveling at 30 miles an hour which means it will cover 30 miles in one hour and obviously this the faster the car goes the quicker the more the quicker it will be and the more mileage it will cover so that's something we might cover a little bit more but the mass today is not going to be that complicated so first of all, before we start, we'll do our song, Days of the Week. Oh. Oh, sorry guys. It's not the one I wanted. Go back. Try again. Sorry. Days of the Week. Days of the week, 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 days of the week. There's Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday. Monday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday. Days of the week, 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 days of the week. There's Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday. Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday. Well done. Okay. That's a big kiss from. Oh, stopping. Oh, doesn't want to stop this one. Right. Okay. So, talking about adding up, I'm going to show you two different ways of adding up and a couple of little games of how we can do some adding. So, the first one I'm going to use to show you is dice. So, we have one dice at three and one dice, oh, we've got two, both at three. So, how can we add those together? Well, we can count the dots, one, two, three, four, five, six. Or we could use our number line and we can go one, two, three plus one, two, three, and our answer will be six. Or you can do it this way you can add one, two, three, and one two three so we can do one two three four five six so they all add up exactly the same way so whatever way is easier for you and you can do different numbers so we'll do another one on this on like on the um dice so here we have one plus five so again if you've got dice you can just use the dots and you can go one, two, three, four, five, six. Still six. Wow. What's the chances? So we can go five 
one, two, three, four, five, plus one is six. Or you can go one, two, three, four, five, plus one. And then we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, plus one is six. So that's the dice. Another way you can find some numbers is I think Lynn's given you some numbers. So you can stir those numbers up and then close your eyes like that. And then just go and see what number you get. Oh, five and one again. We had that last time with the dice, didn't we? It's the same thing, except you've got no spots there. So instead of the spots, what we can do is we can go five, one, two, three, four, five, plus one, or add one, is six. If that, or you can do objects. Oops, taking them away. I want those. I'm a bit of a pickle, me. Shell's a bit of a pickle today. So we can go one, two, three, four, five, one. So we can go five, add one. So we go is one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's two different ways you can do that. And so you can have a bit of fun adding. So you can use numbers and mix them up, or you can use two dice and throw them. Um, go up to 10, go up to as much as you can go. It doesn't matter. All right, just play about with the numbers a little bit and play about with either your number line, getting used to using your number line or some objects. Either way, it doesn't really matter. The idea is you have fun and enjoy it as well as learning. So tomorrow I will come back to you with some more things. I can't believe I'm seeing, I'm doing this all week. Um, I'm not sure if I'm getting any better at it, but I hope you have fun. And if you do go out for a walkabout, don't forget to look about See if you can see what different ways of crossing the road you can use. And also, I'll be looking at these a bit more, but looking at some signs. But we'll be looking a little bit more at that tomorrow. But definitely see if you can see any of these signs, the number signs, so that you know how fast cars should be going. In the meantime, have fun and try it and I look forward to seeing all this hard work that you're going to be doing bless you and um, see you tomorrow bye